Hello everyone, Aaron here, and it's Same Computing. Today I'm going to be doing a tutorial based on Facebook. Now before I start, I just want to say that I apologise for the delay that it took from my last tutorial till now. Reason being, I've had a lot of issues that I've needed to uh, get sorted. Um, so now I'm going to be back doing some tutorials. So this is going to be my first one again. And as I say, it's going to be based on Facebook. Now, a lot of people have been complaining of their profiles or their accounts being hacked. Um, and basically it's because you can now enable a secure connection with your uh, account. Meaning, rather than having the HTTP uh, double dot slash slash and then your website name, so www.facebook.com, they are now allowing you to use a HTTPS, which is basically an SSL certificate, which is enabled throughout the site. And an SSL is a secure socket layer, meaning that it's just a highly, well not highly, it's more of a, a um, security type script that allows you to talk to Facebook server to do what you need to do within Facebook. So anything you want to do on your profile, settings, anything like that, it just makes it a tighter uh, script to stop anyone actually getting in and changing anything on there. So as, at the moment you can see mine set, I've got the green padlock and then the, the green HTTPS. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to pause the video, I'm going to take it off and then I'm going to show you how to apply it. It's not hard, it's literally just selecting one uh, one checkbox, but for me to change it and then show you how to enable it, it's just pointless because I'm basically showing you where it is. So I'm just going to pause the video and I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. I've changed the uh, HTTPS, I've turned it off, and as you can see now it's just www.facebook.com. So I've got no green padlock and no green HTTPS there. So basically what I need to do to change that is go into my account settings. Um, I will just note now, I won't be clicking on my home or my profile to show you that that does work throughout the site. Uh, you are going to have to trust me and I, I do 100% tell you that it does work throughout whatever pages you're on. But the reason for me not showing my home or profile, obviously, I don't want to show my friends' names um, as they may not want other people trying to add them as a friend or any any weird stuff, basically. Um, I'm sure you wouldn't like someone showing your name and then maybe someone looking and seeing that and then trying to do anything to your account or trying to add you that they don't know. So that's the reason I'm just looking at my friend requests because I know I've got nothing there and there's nothing to show any of my friends. So it's just a way for me to make sure that they don't get any bother, that's all basically. So what we need to do is click on account and come to account settings. And down at the account security, it says set up secure browsing, HTTPS and login alerts. So I want to change that one. And at the top you see secure browsing. So if we check that box, and that tells us that browse Facebook on a secure connection, HTTPS, whenever possible. So we save that. And as you can see, it's already changed. But I'm going to go back to my friend request. And as you see, I've now got my padlock and the green HTTPS and then my facebook.com so oh, sorry so uh, basically it, it just helps secure your connection with Facebook servers and it basically it prevents people from trying to hack your Facebook so I hope that helps you and uh, I'll have some more tutorials up soon cheers guys